Hey everyone, in this video I want to show you how to fix any issues that you're having as far as regarding your computer freezing. Um, there's, there's a lot of things that can cause a computer to freeze. Um, usually there's, uh, you can have issues with your um, software, software conflicts, you can have um, issues with the drivers between those softwares, um, it can be a memory issue, um, there's, there's a lot of different things that can cause issues with your computer and cause it to clean up. And one of the easiest things you can do is, is use um, a, a software that will help um, optimize your PC and get it running uh, normal again. So there's a few things you, you'll want to do in, in order to do that. But one of, the, one of my favorite pieces of software is um, this uh, PC Health Advisor. And what it does is it, it, it allows you to um, automatically scan your computer for any issue that you're having. And it also allows you to update uh, your drivers. So the first thing you're going to want to do is there's a link below this video that will take you to the software download page. It's at pchealthcheck.org um, slash computer hyphen freeze. Um, you can type that in or you can just click the link below this video. It's probably the easiest thing to do. And what it does is you can, you can download the software and it'll give you a free scan of your computer. So you can see where you have issues and what could be causing your computer to freeze. So the software does a lot of things. Um, I, I'm not going to go over every single thing that it does, but I want you to I want to go over the things that will help your computer um, become uh, hopefully unfrozen. So um, it obviously does a lot of things. You know, it optimizes your speed and performance. Uh, this is critical here, updating drivers. That's one of the huge things that can cause a computer to freeze. And then, you know, it does things with security and uh, it has other tools and, and things like that. And the thing that I like about, about just using, uh, I use a lot of software from this company. Um, I call the Pareto Logic, is because they are um, a Microsoft partner, um, Intel partner, accredited with the Better Business Bureau, and their software products uh, work very well. And I've been very pleased with um, a lot of the tools that they put out. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to do, what, what you need to do to, um, to help with that, uh, with that issue. Okay, once you download the software and you install it, this is what this is what the first screen is going to look like. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go ahead and just do um, just do a simple scan. And what it's going to do, it's going to run and it's going to it's going to do a registry scan. Um, re registry entries are made um, typically when you install uh, programs on your uh, PC, but a lot of times you install things you uninstall, you install, you uninstall and you end up with a lot of registry entries that aren't needed anymore. And those registry entries can, uh, can cause your computer to be slow. So um, as you can see, the software is running and it's picking up all the, all the registry uh, issues that I'm having. So I'm going to pause this video for a minute and then come back once it, once it finishes the scan. Okay, you can see that the scan is complete. And at the, in the bottom here, you can see it found a um, 1,018 different items, um, the majority of those obviously being registry problems. Um, I am running this on an old computer, so this has got um, quite a few problems on it. Um, so w once you run it, what you do is you just click the fix all, and it'll go ahead and fix those. But in order to fix them, um, you will have to purchase a license. Um, I think it's normally in uh, around forty dollars, but um, I think the link below this video takes it. Uh, I have a discount link. I'm not sure how long it's going to last, but it, it makes it uh, around twenty nine dollars. Um, but the thing is, it's not something you're going to run once. This is something you're going to run periodically in order to keep your system clean and keep it running. So, um, and there's a lot of there's a lot of cool features of the software. I also want to show you. The scan, this is the first thing you need to do, is you need to run the scan and you need to, you need to, to fix these problems. 
get these problems fixed first. Then I'm going to click cancel and go back here just because I want to show you what else you're going to need to do. So once you do the scan and you um, go ahead and get all those fixed, the next thing you're, you're going to want to do is click on this right here, the driver manager, because that's, that's a huge problem um, as far as um, computer crashes and computer freezes. So you click on that and it's going to go ahead and it's going to do a scan um, on all your drivers uh, to determine if any of them need to be, um, to be updated. So in this case, I've got six that need to be updated. Um, I've got my sound, uh, my sound card, my uh, USB controllers. Um, those are the USB ports that are, you know, hanging out of your computer, and they're attached to the motherboard, and, and those have drivers also. Um, these other system devices, display adapters, um, and and other network adapters. So you just click on these, you download them, and then. Once you download them, you can uh, install them and they'll update your, uh, update your drivers. So you can do this on your own. You can go to the company websites and, you know, each one of these uh, items, like, for instance, like this, uh, this audio card, you could go to their website and get the, the download. You could do it, you know, with a little bit of research, but I found it's kind of a pain because you have to dig through their site and go to the right place in order to download it. This does it automatically. The software keeps a, an updated driver database. Um, which makes it really easy to go and get those drivers updated. So once you do those two things, hopefully your computer is going to be running uh, much better. And that's the idea here is to get it running better. Um, and it has definitely kept my my main computer running extremely smooth, and and I haven't really had any problems. So um, so go ahead and um, if you want, you know, you can you can get that license. I believe it's still twenty nine dollars. Just click the link below this video, or once you download it. And then you do a, uh, a fix all. It'll it'll probably take you there. I'm, I'm pretty sure. So anyway, I hope that was helpful. And uh, good luck.